All right, so early this morning, we got a new data download on the global side of the game. Uh, a massive data download, actually, with a lot of assets. So in this video, we are gonna be breaking down everything that it contained. But before we jump in, I do wanna give a shout out to my boy Proton10MG on Twitter for posting all the assets. If you guys aren't already following him, then definitely go ahead and do so. He is getting closer to 10K followers and he definitely deserves a lot more than that. So yeah, with that said, let's scroll down a little bit here and start with the first thing, which is a new promo movie for Global's next Dokkan Festival unit, which as you guys can see is Bardock. So let me just uh, pause the music here and enjoy. There you go, Bardock arrives. That's the Tech Dokkan Festival exclusive Bardock. And uh, of course, he's always been one of my favorite characters um, in the Dragon Ball franchise. So I am pretty excited for this release. So that is the promo, which you'll see when the unit actually comes out. And uh, I'm not sure if I said the release date, but in case I didn't, it's gonna be March 1st, which is in about a week from now. So we have the SSR form of the Bardock, as well as the TUR. And from there, we have his side banner unit as well, which is an Int Tora, who awakens into... I mean, the art includes the rest of the members of Team Bardock, but I believe the name of the unit is still just Tora. So yeah, there is the side banner unit. And then from there, we have the new Dokkan event for Bardock, as well as his Dokkan Awakening Medal. We also have the Extreme Z Battle Event assets for the AGL LR Gohan, who is an absolute monster. He is arguably the best Extreme Z Awakened unit in the game right now, so I'm very, very stoked for this one. And uh, yeah, some more assets for the Gohan. There you go. And then the other side, of course, is the uh, Extreme Z Awakening for the Int LR Cell, who is also very good. Also very good. Um, I don't think quite as impressive or useful, maybe, as the Gohan, but he is still uh, a very good Extreme Z Awakening, right? So there you have the Cell assets. Uh, yeah, some more Cell right there. And then we have the 27th Explosive, no, yes, Explosive Chain Battle. Explosive Chain Battle. I forgot what the E stood for for a second. I was like, is it Extreme? Or something else, but it's Explosive Chain Battle, number 27, versus Hachiak. And then we also have a Dokkan Festival ticket, of course, which is for the Dokkan Festival banner for Bardock. And, uh, you know, as always, this will be available for purchase with money in the pack shop. And, uh, yeah, then we have some untranslated assets and you guys can probably recognize these from the 8th anniversary this is the countdown or these are the countdown screens for the 8th anniversary which is not coming to global for another five months so it feels very early for us to get these but i think they do this every year so it's not really like a surprise it's just you know kind of a tease because we're so far away from the actual anniversary right so uh, some countdown screens, we have uh, a bunch of maps, and I can't say exactly uh, which events they're for, but I'll give you guys a quick look. Uh, one thing to keep in mind is that a lot of the assets we see here are for events um, or units that are not ready for release yet, right? So a lot of them are untranslated, a lot of them are just added to the database for, you know, future release, right? Like we got some like Super Battle Road maps and stuff like that. Um, yeah, for future release, but they're not necessarily going to be released anytime soon. I think a good amount of these are related to the anniversary, so um, yeah, we probably won't see uh, a bunch of these until you know later on in the year. But uh, yeah, lots and lots of maps. If you guys just want to take a quick look, if not, then feel free to skip ahead a little bit. But I will show you guys everything because that's the point of these videos. 
Um, okay, so next up we have a few Extreme Z battles, and once again, they're not ready for release. There is the Int Super Saiyan 3 Bardock Extreme Z battle, as well as the uh, Int LR Bojack Extreme Z battle events, untranslated. We also have the Dokkan Festival exclusive Yamcha, uh, who is also not going to be released probably for... I mean, I guess given the release order on JP, at least a month, I would say. At least a month, like maybe late March or something like that. We'll see him. And then uh, we have this uh, Super Saiyan Kid Trunks and Super Saiyan Kid Goten. We have uh, Yajirobe, who I believe is the side unit for the Yamcha. And we also have the uh, LR Hachiak. We have... Uh, oh, these guys are already in the game, actually, but I believe it's some um, fixes to their quotes. Uh, yeah, card fixes to Korean and Japanese super attack quotes. There you go. Oh, and also, oh, pretty much every other unit in the status download. Okay, so maybe there was some issue with the Korean and Japanese quotes, right? So they fixed that for a lot of units in the status download. Uh, we also have another chain battle boss, which is this first form Frieza. And then a bunch of things related to like standby skills, standby conditions. Um, those are for, you know, the 8th anniversary units. So not something we'll, we'll see anytime soon unless, unless we get the uh, new mechanic early, which sometimes does happen, right? So uh, maybe for, you know, Saiyan Day or for like Goku, Goten, and Gohan Day, we'll see... Um, you know, a unit with a standby skill, and then Global will just get that, you know, um, mechanic early instead of having to wait until the anniversary to get our first standby skill unit. Um, yeah, anyways, with that said, we have some trade jewels right here, some like God Dragonstone, Blue Dragonstone, or Premium Dragonstone, I think it's called. Or no, what's the Blue Dragonstone called? I forgot, but yeah, Blue and Red Dragonstones, a couple of other trade jewels. We have the 8th anniversary ticket. We have, uh, a random box and also a support item. I forgot exactly what this does to be honest. We have uh, a few untranslated support memories. There's the Cell and Gohan. We have a dying Gohan right there support memory. Um, we have uh, the Dokkan Awakening Medal. Awakening Medal for the uh, Yamcha. We have the Extreme Z Awakening Medals for Super Saiyan 3 Bardock as well as LR Bojack and also the Super Battle Road uh, STR LR Trunks. Um, Extreme Z Awakening Medals for the Free to Play, uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, um, some other assets related to like standby skills and stuff like that, which are, I mean, this is the revival skill thing, but uh, basically, yeah, assets related to upcoming mechanics, uh, revival skill, standby skill, revival counterattack, interesting, finish effect charge once again, 8th anniversary stuff, or maybe earlier. And then we have exchange icons for uh, the Baba Shop, and this one's new for the new update. Uh, we finally can exchange units for the... Um, what, what's the accepted name for these coins now? Like teal or green coins, I guess? Anyways, carnival coins. Carnival coins. Uh, oh, Peton battle related assets. So there's the new pack. There is the, I guess, like folder image right there. And then just a bunch of Peton battle cards. I'm not going to click into each of them individually because there's a lot. And I don't want this video to be like 20 minutes long. But feel free to take a look. We got, you know, some Goku, some Vegeta, some Cell, some Gohan, uh, some Bojack, right? Some Bojack. You got uh, LR, Vegeta, and Nappa. Some more Goku, Krillin, uh, Great Ape right there. And also this uh, LR... Vegeta, it's the exchange of LR Nappa and Vegeta, right? So there's the Vegeta. And then also a bunch of scripted assets. We got a couple of Vegetas, uh, a bunch of Yamchas for, you can assume, Yamchas Dokkan events, Android 19, Dr. Jiro or 20, uh, my girl Android 18, 17, 16, uh, Booty Hercule, King Vegeta. Uh, Bardocks, which we will see because of the new Bardock in Trunks. Um, Fasha, forgot her name for a second, I don't know why. Tora, <laughs> Borgos, Shugesh, can't forget him. Uh, Super Saiyan Youth Gohan, a couple of Kid Trunkses, a couple of 
I was gonna say go tens, but I guess there's no go ten here. Um, the L R int Gohan uh, cell, a couple more cells. There's the gross. Uh, uh, what do you call it? That when he transforms, I guess, or like evolves again. Um, it's, it's it's pretty gross. And then <laughs> there's Super Trunks. There is King Cold. Uh, Mecha Frieza, Goten, okay, Broly, um, a couple of uh, legendary Super Saiyan Broly's. Uh, we got, you know, Paragus, his dad. Yo, I'm really bad with names right now. My brain is like not firing on all cylinders at the moment. Uh, a couple of Super Saiyan Gokus, a couple of Super Saiyan Gokus from uh, actually the cooler movie. And then we have Kid Gohan, a couple of uh, Teen Gohans. I was gonna say, is it gonna be called Adult Gohan or Teen Gohan? It is Teen Gohan, but sometimes they call him, or I mean, I guess he, he's a teen here, but like, he's also called teen in the new movie, even though he's not a teen. Doesn't matter. Uh, the point is, Gohan, and then we have Fidel, uh, we have Krillins, we have, uh, oh, oh, I'm not gonna show these because I feel like it's a little questionable. So, a uh, baby Broly and baby Goku. And then at the end, we have, a new burst mode, which is for a Tyrannical Galactic Warrior. That would be the Bojack event. And we can get Bojack's theme, as well as theme for Promise to Dad. I think that's the one for what the LR Super Saiyan, Tech Tech Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, right? I think so, I think so. But anyways, uh, Bojack's theme is one of my favorite themes in the entire game, so I'm super excited to be able to get that for sure. And, uh, you know, just a new burst mode as well, which is, um, I guess, the first one since the original came out, right? So, uh, yeah, those are all the assets, guys, for this data download. There was a lot of stuff. Like I said, a massive, massive data download. I'll do a pass or pull video for the Bardock when we get closer to his release for now. Um, I just know that he's about a week away. And uh, if you guys are planning to summon for him, if you guys want him, then definitely... You know, save some stones for that. And uh, that is the data download, guys. That is all there is to say. Once again, thank you to Proton for hosting the assets. These videos would not be possible without him. And um, that's the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows. You want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Video. Signing out.